All right, welcome everybody to another episode of Python scripting for Blender. Today we will look at the context and the operators in Blender and how to use them through scripting. We will do this through a simple example. We will select and activate a cube and then we want to switch mode from object mode to edit mode. All right, so here we have a nice cube. And if you would like to see which objects are selected, you can go to bpi.context.selectedObjects. That will give you a list of the selected objects, and in this case, that is the cube. All right, so if we deselect the cube, you will see the list will become empty. So, if you want to check which object is active, you can go to bpi.context.viewlayer.objects.active. And here you can see that at this moment, the light is actually the active object. Okay, so let's say we wanted to select and make the cube active. We would go to bpi.data objects then we would set, take the cube then you would go to select set and you would say true and you can see now in the view that the cube is selected if you want to make it active also because this doesn't have to be the case you can go to context to view layer objects active and set this to bpi.data.objects cube. And then you'll see the outline of the cube actually turns orange. So now it's selected and it's active. Nice. All right, let's say we would want to switch from object mode to edit mode. You can check the mode that you are in through bpi.context.mode. Then you will see that we are currently in object mode. If you want to change this, you need to use a operator. You can go to bpy.ops. You will need to use an operator to do this. Then you want operators that work on objects. So we go to dot object. Then we go to edit mode toggle. And then you see if you do that, it toggles to edit mode. And if you do it again, it toggles back to object mode. More general, you can also go to mode set, and then you can say, okay, I want this a specific mode to activate. And you can go to the edit mode, and you can go back to the object mode. So here you see that you can use bpi.context to check the context of Blender, which mode it is in, uh, what kind of active object you have. You can also find operators uh, in bpi.context. OPS, and in this case we used operators to toggle between the object and edit mode uh, and to set a specific mode using uh, mode set. Alright, I hope this was useful and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!